steps are gonna take. Uh, it's, just, it's just my style. It's like the, it's how I like to wear. I like my jersey up. I also like how long the jersey gets. But uh, I mean, the refs keep trying to make me take it down every week. So. Zeke, you guys have uh, put up a ton of yards, almost 500 yards of offense. You had some critical mistakes, and you guys still ended up winning after those turnovers. What does it say about you guys to be able to come in and, and win in spite of some costly turnovers? Uh, we're a certain team that grinds. You know. We never backed down, but I mean, we made a lot of critical mistakes that could cost us in bigger games today. And uh, I mean, like you say, we had a lot of yards, but we just didn't. We had that fumble on the goal line. We had those turnovers; those are those are not good. You said that the, it could cost you in bigger games. Do you think that you guys could? I mean, last week you did it have some mistakes as well in Michigan State, but I mean, how important is it for you guys to avoid that, especially if you're going to be playing in some big games coming up? Well, against a good team like Minnesota. Minnesota, they're very good at special teams, very good in the field position battle. Seemed like every other drive, we were starting inside of 20. We hadn't started inside of 20 since the uh, Virginia Tech game, so I mean, they were very good field position wise, and so against a team like that, you can't make mistakes like that. Ezekiel, on a day like this, do you have to have faith in your offensive line to come out cold and know you have to run the ball on a day like this? I mean, every game we got to believe in our O line. Our O line is the heartbeat of our team. They go, the rest of the team goes. So, I mean, if they're clicking, we're all going to click. Obviously, you don't want to turn the ball over, but the last two weeks you guys have had problems with turnovers. You still went on the road against two top 25 teams and came up with a win. What's that say about this team? It just shows that, like, I think we're almost there. We're almost where we need to be. We, we keep making these little dumb mistakes, but without those mistakes, the game last week and the game this week would have been a different outcome. Jalen's a friend of yours, uh, I would think. Jalen Marshall. Mm -hmm. I mean, what, what's your message to him and stuff to, after those two turnovers today? Well, I just got to keep his head up. He's been making a lot of good plays this season. He's really uh, gotten a lot better this season. I just, uh, just got to keep the ball tighter, and uh, that's just a mental thing. He's got to work on that during practice. Did you think JT Barrett had this kind of these kind of running stats in him? Are you a little surprised? What, what's your take on JT yeah. Barrett now? Uh, Ten games in. Uh, he's a sneaky runner. He's he's not. It doesn't seem like he has that much speed, but somehow he always seems to break away. He has some nice moves in open field. So I mean, I've seen JT a lot in practice, make some guys miss, but uh, I mean, he's he's doing very well running the ball this year.